And now, Rod a brief Lord, reading. Your father's cave and left us alone. <laughs> we mm. had difficulty mm. in speaking mm. at first. Yeah. I was shy. Mm. It was a simple gown caught lightly at the waist by a gossamer mm. thread. Mm. Yeah. All else mm. was shaped by Mona herself. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Her breasts were like pomegranates, or what you will. <laughs> wait, wait, but wait, like nothing so uh, much as a wait, young wait, wait, woman's what? breasts. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, what? Uh, no! No, no, this is this is good stuff. Uh, this is, uh, no. Oh, we oh, came okay, here for. Okay, all right. We didn't come here for uh, this. What else have we got here? Oh, yes. A woman will often inspire a man to create his masterpiece, <laughs> then prevent him from carrying huh? it out. <laughs> what, what? Oscar what? Wilde what? said that, I, and then I, I wrote it down. <laughs> what a wild fellow. <laughs> Oscar Wilde never no, said no, that. No, he, he did say it. No, no, no. What do you... No, you in the back... Shush! No, uh, so he did say it. I wrote it down. Okay, okay. Um. Well, well, I've got a model of the endocrine system. If that, if that's of interest, you've got the hypothalamus. Why do you have it only modeled after the man? The th what do you mean? No, I'm. I'm, I'm Why do you treat the guy like the default character? Same. No, I haven't treated the man as a default character. Okay, but well, what else have I got here? Oh, okay, okay. Magic and witchcraft. Oh, here we are. Oh, I know what you want. <laughs> Take a shoe that the woman you love has worn. Fill it with rue and What the heck is this? Get to the good part. Wait, what is oh, what? That's not it. No, uh, to win a maiden's love, get a hair and a pillow. Oh, that's not it. Okay. Um, you may fascinate a woman by giving her a piece of cheese. Yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. he did. Yes. He said he oh, that, that's, that's, that's what you, that that's what you wanted, say. yes. Yeah, <laughs> you in the back, you, that's you what you wanted, thing. too. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I yeah. know women, yeah. I know more than one, in fact, yeah. oh, yes, and I've written yeah. it about women. Yeah. Yes, I am Ooh. very knowledgeable. <laughs> wow. Hi, everyone. <laughs> you may notice that something is different. I wanted to talk to you about that a little bit before we start today's video. Quite a while ago, in November 2019, was when I decided to start dyeing my hair blue. And I've talked about that a little bit before on the channel, uh, more recently on stream. A big reason behind that was because of a video that we made. I was talking about how some parents were interacting with their kid, where they were texting each other pictures of lesbian haircuts on the internet and mocking their kid. And I thought to myself, well, heck, that is like the coolest hair ever. I'm going to go out to a stylist, show them that exact picture and get it done. <laughs> and I did. And I posted some pictures. I talked about it a bit, um, but I didn't start doing on camera stuff until uh, I think the start of the next year and so I just kept it going and I've kept that hair going for quite a while yeah, up until all the way November 2021 by the way it's almost 2022 don't feel old <laughs> and I thought why don't I try doing something that I've been thinking about doing for quite a while I'll change the color a little bit change the cut a little bit <laughs> I hope you like it as I do <laughs> All right, my beardos and weirdos, we're diving into r slash men writing women today. <laughs> Let's get started. I can't take anymore. She cried, exhausted after three hours bent over the desk. It was no good. She just couldn't remember her password. <laughs> God dang it. <laughs> Cop! Can you describe the woman who stabbed you? Male author. <gasps> Lithe, spirited, outgoing, and not afraid to speak her mind. She was a raw sexual force and she knew it. She was dandelion fluff on a summer day, gone in an instant, leaving you with nothing but the memory of her touch and the faint taste of strawberries on your lips. Cop! Great, we have a motive, but we still need a description. <laughs> I'm gonna write about roosters and basketballs the way male writers write about boobs! <laughs> his acorns once so full and heaving in the summers of his youth now clung to his pelvis as a reminder of the cold and his powerlessness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so true! Oh, it's true! Okay, I, re <laughs> I really like that. <laughs> Please read this. Oh, no. 
<laughs> myself over her and then drag my boobies across her back. Just b wait, what? Just barely touching her skin with them. Slowly, ever so achingly, slowly, I trail my na- Okay, all right. <laughs> Down her butt and to the top of her thighs. Wait, hang on. <laughs> ah, her hips are really gro- Okay. Inspired, I take my right boobie in my hand and stuff it up into her cra- Oh, come on. So she can feel my flesh all up and down. Okay, her heat rises is higher and her hips move more ferociously through my booby into it no 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 okay all right i think uh, i think you need a license to be able to create content and um this person's license should be revoked <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. I need an adult. <laughs> a male author is insisting that he is living proof that it's possible for a male author to write an authentic female protagonist. Here's a quote from his first page. I sauntered over. Certain he noticed me. I'm hard to miss, I'd like to think. A little tall, but not too tall. A nice set of curves, if I do say so myself. Pants so impossibly tight that if I had a credit card in my back pocket, you could read the expiration date. The rest of my outfit wasn't that remarkable. Just a few old things I had lying around. Haha, <laughs> you know how it is. <laughs> Oh, fella. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Dear men writers, lesser known facts when writing women. High heeled shoes don't become flats if you break the heel off. Huh. <laughs> the posts of earrings aren't sharp. Nail polish takes a long time to dry and smudges when wet. You can't hold in a period like a pee. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Inserting a tampon is not arousing or sexual in any way, ever. Feel free to add your own. <laughs> How embarrassing it must be to be a male writer sometimes. <laughs> when instead of, I don't know, asking the people around you, if you have any women around you, <laughs> what certain things are like, you just gotta, I don't, you kind of wing it and go this far off the rails. <sighs> oh, man. <laughs> Why is male country music like? Got girls in teeny tiny shorts. I will make you my wife. Bear my children. Front porch. Family values. Cash the rules. <laughs> and female country music is like. Oops, I killed my husband. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> I don't know. They're both kind of aspirational, aren't they? <laughs> From wildly different perspectives. Mm. <laughs> Hello, fellas. Said the hotter wife works, the cuter she looks. Ah, gosh, honey gal. You seem to thrive on cooking, cleaning, and dusting. And I'm all tuckered out by closing time. What's the answer? Vitamins, darling. I always get my vitamins. Vitamins for pep. Pep for vitamins. <laughs> Kellogg's pep. No. Is this real? No, is it re- Is it, is it, is it drugs? It might be. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> All I can think about is our grandparents wishing for a white Christmas with lots of snow. <laughs> Male writers trying to write a female character in a mental breakdown like, uh, oh, <laughs> oh no, <laughs> no. Okay. All right. All right. That's, that, that, that's, 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 that's getting two magic school buses. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Hello there, I'm a woman in a post-apocalyptic society and I wake up every day with perfect eyeliner and zero body hair. Hi, I'm a woman in an apocalypse who raids abandoned shops for supplies, but I never need pads or tampons because I guess I never have my period. <laughs> Hi, I'm a woman in a post-apocalyptic society and this hunting jacket was my father's. He was a woman size four. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God dang it. Uh, <laughs> I'm actually done. I refuse to read a book with a female character in it written by a man over 40. I never thought I ever had to read the phrase, She had D cup guts, but a trainer bra brain. I don't even know what the fuck that means. How every author writes a guy kissing another guy for the first time. Bruce had kissed girls before, of course, but this was so different. Girls were all soft and curves and pliant, sighing beneath him, pliant and submissive. But kissing David was nothing like that. His stubble burned Bruce's mouth. His kisses hard and aggressive and bruising. 
<laughs> mouth to mouth combat. <laughs> Every place Bruce's hand searched for soft curves, they found hard planes and angles. Come on. Come on. You think David don't have any cake? Come on. <laughs> on top of her ankles, wrapped in a dominant five o'clock shadow, nothing like a supple, tender, mild girl. <laughs> David was a dodecahedron with 12 faces and five ankles on each. He had a total of 60 entire ankles. <laughs> <laughs> the entire outer mass had been covered in a five o'clock shadow. The stubble burned as he rolled him. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Anti-tampon tax menace Ryan Williams says women should control their bladders. No. No. <laughs> Teenage menace sparks. Okay, what is a meninist? <laughs> Teenage Meninist sparks fury with anti-tampon rant as he tells women to just control their bladders. <laughs> Ryan Williams, 19, was baffled when people told him he may need a lesson in biology after he declared tampons are a luxury item because it's all about self-control. <sighs> I'm... Uh... <laughs> What's that thing that Toby says about Dwight in the office? That he's just sad that the public school system failed him so much? I kind of feel like that when I read something like this. You shouldn't be thinking this. Certainly not when you're an adult. <laughs> my roommate used to be really rude to me until she saw my big secret. <gasps> you're still sleeping? <laughs> you're such a... Uh, uh, horse? Horse? an odd thing to keep in bed with you <laughs> a big bed then <laughs> what the fudge <laughs> some game developers actually need to learn that when women die they don't release the same sound that they would when having an organism oh <laughs> oh fellas <laughs> hello fellas hey gals be the first doll of any girl in your office ha <laughs> ha wouldn't that be fun have it sitting around with all, with all the fellas and they're uh, closely inspecting your work as it were ha <laughs> ha mm, the the, the typing typing work that you're doing yes the mmm the... uh, this kind of feels like the thing of nightmares you know was this meant to be a positive advertising campaign this feels like a warning stay away from whatever the Olivetti thing is. I don't know if that's the typewriter. I don't know if it's like a cologne. I j just run. Dad. Someone suddenly shouted from behind him. Primus turned around. She was as tall as any man could ask for. Her boobies hidden by her chaste dress were perky, tantalizing people wherever she went. Her long legs were admired by just as many men, even called art by some. Her waist was so thin that one could wrap their hands around it and almost touch their fingers together. Ah, uh, okay. So like that? And I don't have small hands. That is not, <laughs> that is not enough. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> when trains were introduced in the US, many people believed that women's bodies were not designed to go at 50 miles per hour and that their uteruses would fly out of their bodies if they accelerated to that speed. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> hey gal, stay fit and slim by taking amphetamines. Oh no, stop. Made for a woman's extra feelings. Oh, secret, 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 secret. Oh, what the fudge? <laughs> for a woman to remain a virgin before marriage is both psychological and biological important. Scientists have discovered that a woman who has relations with multiple men have come to retain the male's DNA in their brain, thus causing her to take on the male pattern behaviors as their own and causing psychological imbalances such as panic attacks and depression. Women who have multiple relations with men has caused to lose the ability to pair bond, thus unable to stay married, ending in divorce because there is no attachment. Oh, what the fudge? Ah. <laughs> oh god. That caused physical pain to read. How can you be so wrong so many times in a single comment? What? The female organism is pure sin. It serves no reproductive function, just selfishness. Jeff, is this satire? Please let this be satire. You can't be this stupid. Jeff, human males don't have a barbed peepee -pee like a cat. 
They have to like us, and they have to like Adult Funtime, or the human race would die. Lol. No reason, my butt. <laughs> Robert, oh, ye poor sweet child. No good woman enjoys Adult Funtime. Real life is not a porn and adult film. <laughs> they do it because they know procreation is the greatest love they can give to their lord and family. I've heard if a woman is pure body, mind, and spirit, she can have an organism during childbirth. If a woman is pure, body, mind, and spirit, she can have an organism during birth. Aren't you just saying it was a sin? So, is she being rewarded with a sin? I don't... Your argument seems to be collapsing unto itself. <laughs> we need to be able to tell which knights are women. I know! <laughs> just get the Lady Knight's heels! <laughs> okay. <laughs> It seems a little impractical for fighting, but I'm like, I, I just, I, I they, they look sharp. Maybe they serve another per I don't know. Maybe you could just have spikes on boots, right? <laughs> they don't need to be heels. <laughs> Fellas, sometimes, you know. <laughs> All right, my bearders and widows, that was our dive into r slash men riding women. I hope you liked today's video. It was a lot of fun to go through with all of you. And I had a really good time. Uh, if you like the sketch style intros, maybe I'll keep them up. We'll see. <laughs> They're a lot of work. <laughs> all right. Let me know what you'd like to see me cover next. And we'll see you in the next one. Where we take it, one topic at a time. Roll that outro. <laughs> it's vision seems to be vape based on vision. Okay. Are you getting married? Oh, quick time event. Q, Q, Q. Q for marriage. <laughs> Toggle Q for marriage. <laughs>